This is an electrical shopping glove. EWS, electrical weaponized shopping glove. And as you can see, it works. Now, as the all the parts here you can get from Home Depot or around the house. This circuit board right here is actually the circuit board of a disposable camera. This was made from a teddy bear, a try me button, um, a ba battery charger with two double A's, zip tie to keep the this in, and then you have your regular wire. And if you listen very closely, I don't know if you can hear it. You could hear a very slight buzzing sound, which it is charging in the capacitor to electrocute a shock. This is actually 200 watts because we upgraded the battery. The battery would actually go right there, but since it doesn't, we can also charge it up, and if I find my screwdriver, we can actually put this. You could have a shock, or you could do a neuralizer, but sometimes this one doesn't work. Yeah, sometimes that one doesn't work, but Anyway, I just gotta take this. I just gotta put those wire racks in place. Yeah, but this is my EWS glove, and I am filming here with Jake. And this will be it. Hmm. Not working. One time, one time. Just trying to. Oh, the wire is touching. Oh, God. Okay. And I would not recommend building this. I would recommend building this with adult supervision, so because it could get an electrical shock with 200 watts. But that's about it. And it's also made with a cut armor. I have to give credit to them because cut armor was my very insulated and obviously cut-free glove that I used, so that I wouldn't shock myself seven times. But yeah. And if you do take it off. I recommend taking out the batteries because this, the capacitor, will still hold a charge for 24 hours or more. That's basically it. See ya.